We're going to tie some of these river streamers here. See, when they get wet, they will get sucked down, look just like a shiner. We're going to tie some of that tonight. We're going to tie some crappie jigs. I'm just going to hang out. So. To get some new eyes here. What's up, 351? How you doing, man? Got some new eyes. Got some little bitty eyes, bunch of different colors and stuff, all the way up to some really huge, really huge ones. Hey, what's up, Mr. Ted? What's up, Corey? How are y'all? Going to, uh, I got a new mold today in. Matt at Want to Be Outdoors sent me a jig mold, a new jig mold. And it's basically a micro, it's a walleye jig mold is what it is. So it's stubby but heavy. I can flip it around. Show y'all so you can see it. Just a little micro, kind of a micro bucktail. Try to make that one look like a sunfish. Got some brown, some green. Yeah, it's a good shape to the head. It's a really, um, Pretty natural shape. Looks like a shiner. Oh. Hey, Mike. Googly? No, they're not googly eyes. They're just a uh, big stick on eyes. We'll make some, make a streamer here and put those big eyes on there. Yeah, these little, uh, these little micro bucktail jigs are gonna be neat. A little classic color there. And then this one right here, I like a lot too. This one's gold and chartreuse. Chartreuse neck with that gold stripe down the side. Got the gold on that side too. Be good, it'll fall slow. I can go from one sixteenth to five eighths with that mold. So it'll be a, just send them here. <laughs> Like, that's the 16th. That's a number six hook. Right there's a 16th. And then, oh, here's a quarter. Or no, yeah. 16th, this is an eighth. This is a quarter. Pretty neat. Good, uh, pretty sweet mold. I like it. I like the short profile. Basically, just a micro bucktail. I mean, it's like two inches long. What are you doing, bud? Yeah, hope everybody's having a good Saturday night. Dylan's running through the house with a slinky. That's what the sound is. Let's tie up one of these streamers so I can put one of these eyes on here because these are huge. Oh, yeah, the one one twenty fourths. I'm excited to see those. Like for you to get them and put them on a penny or something. Love the compatibility. Oh, compactability. Yeah, he's he's a monster, all right. These come with a. Uh, these eyes come with a set of tweezers. Bye.
those eyes I ordered come with a set of tweezers. Hey, Papa. How are you tonight? And how's Mamma? Hope everybody's doing good. Dylan's. That's probably about enough with the slinky, buddy. <laughs> Loud. I'm gonna start off with just a normal. It's just a must add. I don't know exactly what kind of hook, but. Oh yeah. Yeah, he tearing it up all right. <laughs> Mamma bingo. Oh yeah, Saturday night. Hey, what's up, Mr. Wild Finn? How you doing, man? Dylan, that slinky's gonna get your hiney in trouble, bud. It won't. <laughs> he said it won't. He knows. All right. So I got all my feathers here, all my streamer building stuff um, laid out. So I wouldn't be digging as much tonight, hopefully. I'm gonna try to make a streamer for catching some smallmouth on the river. Cause next spring I'm gonna try to have a um, a fly fishing kind of not really series, but try to make a few videos with the fly rod, with the kayaks, and go catch some smallmouth. So. What I'm gonna do is grab a few of these. Malone loves that thread trick. Man, I was watching a like a professional dude tie today, or I guess he's professional. He thinks he is. Uh, he was messing around with that wire bodkin thing, trying to get it through there. I was like, man, if he only knew. He only knew. Yeah, he thinks he is for sure. Get those feathers on there like that. I just like saying it every time. It is a, it's a good trick, man. It definitely, uh, definitely helps. Well, anybody been out fishing? Who's caught a fish so far this year? I know I have not caught a fish in 2024. You complain about it every year. I complain about it. Five-year-old raising hates too. Okay. Running. It was good. You've caught a fishy? Nice. Nice. Oh, Dylan, did you break him? You broken? What is it? What did he break? The panda. Oh, yeah, that thing's cooked. He shoved a double A battery in there and it got jammed and broke like a little pin on the. 
Yeah. It's done. I've caught a fishy on the shorts. Week behind on fish, tomorrow's day seven, 97 fish. That would be cool, Travis. Catch, catch uh, 365 fish this year. That'd be sweet. That's a good goal, man. Seven. Today's the seventh. The seventh. The sixth. All right, now I'm going to cover those feathers up with some bucktail because it's. You what? Yeah. Dylan, he's he's hyper tonight. He's on it. I think he ate a um one of those big chocolate balls that you're supposed to put in your hot cocoa. He just ate it straight. Yeah, he ate a hot chocolate bomb. Where did he get it from? Lord knows, huh? Bag here? I have absolutely no clue. I don't know where Mr. West Boundary Coons is at. Ain't no telling. Oh, yeah, I bet he is. I'm sorry. You're not in trouble for it, buddy. I'm not in trouble. I'm just running around. Hey, hey, hey. Get those radioactive ones. Do what? The radioactive what? Oh, yeah. For sure. That slinky would get on. Why is it wet? Why is the slinky wet? Did you drag it through Grace's water bottle? Water bottle? Yeah. That drop shot. Wait, why is it not working? Why is it not Yeah, Travis is good with that drop shot now. Try to get this flash all straightened out. I know what's wrong with it. You ain't got no gas in it. Oh, Jolly Bates is cool. Yeah, he's a uh, he's a good dude. I put two or three. Daddy, no. Even four hooks on the drop shot at the big lake. I'm for it, Travis. Make like a Daddy. sabiki rig type Daddy. thing. Daddy. What am I looking at? No. Spider Man Pez. That's yeah. crazy. That's crazy. Uh, hey, Jay. No. Jigs were mailed out yesterday. Estimate it be there Monday. Awesome. I'm excited, thank you, sir. And I'll get uh, as soon as I get that uh, get that package in, I'll have your address, and I'll send you some jigs, some homemade stuff here back, back to you. I've got some Palmer chenille. I'm gonna put on here too. Just add a little bit more flash on it. Yeah, 
Gave three foot. I have about three foot lead and a hook every six inches. Absolutely, man. Just add a little bit more color under here because I'm about to cover it up with some fur. It's coming out. Thundercat cap. Oh, yeah. Um, it's a Puma. It's a, one of the types of machines that I run at work. It's a company, Tech Mac. Whatever. Thunder Thunder. So that had a little more flash and color under it. I need some fur. I'm old. My favorite cartoon. Oh, Thunder. Thundercats. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, that was a little bit before me. This is just a strip of craft fur from from Hobby Lobby. That store's dangerous if you've got any money in your pocket and going in there with the thought of tying flies or tying any kind of jigs or anything. You can spend some cash up in a Hobby Lobby. Yeah, the Thundercats. Okay, we're gonna pick up, we're gonna get a dozen donuts in the morning. Oh, okay. Did you make sure it was okay? If she had them? Hmm? With, can she can? Okay. Yeah. I asked mom if she thought I should just get six for her room or a whole dozen. Hey. Yeah. So we'll just use it for both of our rooms. Okay. Perfect. Where the doctor pepper. It ain't far. It don't get far out of arm's reach. Man, we got that uh, Northeast Slab Hunters order all done up. Ten of those blue and chartreuse with the crystal flash in there. Got those done up earlier today. Look mighty fine, thank you. It's upside down. You're upside down. All right, now it's looking a little more, a little more uh, bait fish e, if that's a word. Spawn gave me a sample of their semi-sealed dubbing. This is acid rain. I'm going to put just a little bit on it on the head of this too. I'll pull it down. 
make a loop. What? I was thinking about that time when I ordered critiques for Dylan's party and then she would let you pay her and then you were like, well, you, you paid for all this crap. Yeah. And that was dumb. That was pretty dumb on my part. <laughs> I wonder if I could use a jig as like a dubbing spinner. I don't know why I don't just build something. I don't know. What, what, did, what, what did you just say? So I don't know why I don't build a, um, build me a dubbing spinner. What's that? It's a little thing that's like on a, huh? What? You can buy them, but I could also just make one. You talking about like how you use your drill? Kind of. Oh, baby, that works just perfect. Don't mess with the drill. No, no, I mean, this is... Made with love. Different. I hadn't seen him. Just add a little bit of color around the around the head of it. Makes you stronger. Oh yeah, yeah. I, mean, I was trying to get that to stay down out of my way. Ain't nothing. Little immune system won't handle. I gotta get some eyes on here. I think I'm going to go with those big, obnoxiously big ones. Big eyes. Just to... It's going to be... Might as well. Oh, yeah. That's going to look sweet. Hopefully, that'll stay on there long enough for me to get my other one on. That's gonna be sweet. Get it resined up and where they won't fall off. My flashlight.
I think it's just you. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, you even got. Yeah, we don't even gotta say it anymore. Just all you gotta say is "bad boys" reference. What? The big eyes. That's some big old eyes. We're gonna get this to go down in there without. Is there any way you could throw me a toothpick? Yeah. They're right by my paint. Thank you. Why do you have a measuring cup? Your son. Oh. Oh, yeah. Put some more up top. All right, hammer, tooth hammer, what? Oh, thank you, Lance. Thank you for playing us. Time to edit. Get that all coated up and sealed up. I'll take it off and show you, show you what we're working with. I have no idea. Oh, uh, got it. Makes more sense. All right. There's a, it's a huge odd shad. It's got that reflective underneath. It's a little bright. There you go. See that reflective? Waiting on your chicken fried steak. I'll show it. Out the back side. All those feathers and stuff there and then that big, look like a shad eye. Of course they're, they're flat. Well, dropped it. There you go. Stripers would be on that out here. Need to learn more about them. Yeah, I, uh, I would like to catch a striper. We'll hang her up and let her... Let her wait on us to take her out, I reckon. I wanna build some purple.
tonight too. I've got that uh, those purple tails. I think I'm gonna make a sinking one that's purple. Tie these lead lead eyes on. Yeah, I put that poll on the community tab and it was like uh, 50% or 48% uh, street streamers, 48% um, crappie jigs, and then like 2% or 3 or 4, whatever. Oh yeah, a little chartreuse with the purple, for sure. I'll make the thread chartreuse. The thread and the eyes. All right, I got some, see if I can find some yellow chartreuse eyes. You voted jigs? I got a bunch of jigs. Oh, I don't think, uh, I don't think he's seen it. Do you see the new mold I got? Got it looped up around my. There we go. Yeah, the little um, these little bucktail jigs. The new, the new mold. It's like a micro bucktail. They're actually a walleye jig mold. The hard plastic one with the curly straw he had drinking juice out of. Where'd you put it? I don't know. I was painting jigs. I filled it up and he took off with it. Look great. Thank you. Yeah. I like the, uh, I like the shape of those heads. I'm gonna try something a little different and see how it works. Almost building like a little spot for that eye to go there. A V head. That's cool. Get that lashed on there good. But it can't move. And we'll come back here and start with the start with the tail. So let's put some let's put some chartreuse feathers out the back. A couple of them. And then we'll cover it up with purple.
I'm gonna go one down each side here. One. Get the lengths about the same. And two. What's up, fish head videos? How you doing? Man, doing the normal tying up stuff. Um, got a little different thing tonight. Got some lead barbell eyes lashed on to just a long shanked mustad, like a streamer hook. It's got the horizontal tie to try to help it stay rolled the correct direction. And we're just building a few streamers for next spring because uh, I'm pretty much over the winter time. Pretty done with it, so. Get the old Midwest bucktail purple out. Cover it up about like that. See here. Fish head, you caught any fish yet this uh this year? Roll that bucktail around the hook shank. That all trimmed up. The baby don't like the broccoli and carrots? Mm -hmm. I didn't even get swallowed on carrots. <laughs> Alright, let's see what else we got. Put a little bit of white bucktail over that. Not a whole lot because I really want that purple to come through. I guess we can put some flash. See, I've got purple flash right there. That'll go good in there.
that all cut up. Oh yeah, see all that? Thank you, thank you. Looking, turning out all right so far. The real trick is going to be this next piece of white. Because I want to bring the white over that bridge. The white hair to come over its nose and then lash it off in front of the hook. What do you think? Huh? You can do it. Have faith. Also, there's a couple people watching this video. Right now? Yeah. Seven. You saying don't mess up? Right. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I'm going to come to the bottom first. Less is more? Yeah, for sure. Corey, Corey is in here, or he was in here. Actually, yeah, yeah, he was in here. So I'll put a little bit over the bottom right now. Get it trimmed up. All right, then we'll get some white across the top. Don't need much, like you said. Just something to almost cover that purple, but not really. About like that. All right, now the, the fun part here. Okay. Like that. That'll pin it down over the cut it back out of the eye of the hook just a hair but didn't turn out horrible
get a little chartreuse nose and get get to tie it off. <coughs> All right. There you go. Flip this around. What do you think? Still see that purple. And looking at it from the front. Got that hair to come down over those eyes and tied it off. Shouldn't go nowhere. When it gets wet, it'll be uh, a little more, a little more like that, but yeah, I like it too, for sure. I think it'll get eight, for sure. Put some sealant on this one. The other one had UV resin, but this one's just a bunch of exposed threads. Get it sealed up. All right, got it all sealed up. Might have to take some of these out and fish with them. We can tie a couple crappie jigs. Thank you, thank you, Papaw. I like it, turned out all right. Bunch of purple. What? What are you doing? You want to come over here? Not really? All right, then. I'm in, I'm, oh, I need comfort. Yeah. Yeah, are you comfort right now? Somewhat. Sitting straight up is very comfortable. Well, lay it down. I can't. Lay it down here. You, you're it's laid down on the couch. Pretzel? Pencil? Pencil shavings? Yeah. Were these sharpening pencils? I guess so. I don't know. I was thinking. I have no idea what to tell you. I don't want chartreuse on this one. I'm going to go, I think, olive or maybe a brown. I think I'll go, go brown. I'm getting low, low on brown. I don't have, oh yeah, I got more. Oh, oh yeah. Out there by our mailbox was just a huge, I know, they graded the road and then it snowed on it. It made a huge mess. Oh well. It is what it is, I reckon. Hey, Mr. Ken. Huh? Living out in the wild.
do this piece of... Yeah. The road's pretty, pretty gross right now. Uh, thank you, Ken. I hated to leave early, but I'd put out a community post about going live at 8 central time. I just kind of... We have people that are different time zones? Oh, yeah. Ken and Big Malone both are eastern time. They're an hour ahead. Right now, that's nine, nine fifty one. What is it here? Eight fifty one. I have my time. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. It's hard, always hard on YouTube to. Sh I mean, it's not hard to share, but I always feel bad about getting on top of other people, and then it's just always kind of a weird, weird feeling. Hey, Skip Jack, Cindy, welcome in. Do we have ice cream? I don't know, baby. Yeah. We do? I think. He's been playing in his room today a lot. Nice. I have my deer tails on top of the ice cream sandwiches. Well, you'll have that. Building her a kayak. Okay. That's still cool. Be a good support and hit the like. <laughs> Thank you, Ken. I appreciate it. I'm not really going, don't have a goal of any look with this one. I was just, I knew I had a bunch of natural looking stuff here, so. I've got those little hackle pliers. Only had one and a half cigarettes today. That's good, Ken. Are you trying to quit or was you just out of them? If you're trying to slow down, that's awesome. Trying to stop. That's awesome, Ken. Hope tells me I smell like smoke all the time. I want to do it to improve her life. That's fantastic, man. Tell your mom quit. 
Yeah, my mom's been quit four years now. Yeah. The just a few days after we found out that we were pregnant with Dylan, she quit kind of the same reason. She just didn't want to smoke with new grandbaby. That's four years this month. And yeah, that's been four years ago now. She's she's been quit. So we're super proud of her for that. Definitely keep it up, Ken. What's his channel name? Boring Fisherman. Sophie doesn't know everybody by name, just by them. Um, Yeah. You have to tell me. Right. I'm trying to use this. Quit the booze four or five years ago. That's awesome, too. January, so almost five. Didn't you just have a birthday or have a birthday coming up or something? I thought you told me you were about to be 34. Whatever it was. Who's 34? Ken. Oh, yeah. I'll catch a fish to that for sure. A boring person is about 60? No. I did not know that. Just had a birthday, December 24th. 34 now. I don't know, Ken. 34. Buster. Buster, the yellow butt. Uh, I'm 30. Yeah, I just turned 30 in October the 19th. putting a little bit of flash in the that hackle that I just put on there. <laughs> I'm the old guy. There we go. Don't put that at me. Don't put that at Daddy either. Do one more loop here. Don't put it on the stairs. Jeez. What? A Nerf dart just whizzed by my by the table. Was that you, Dylan? Yeah. No. Oh, okay. I was just making sure. I have no idea.
Hitting good or bad? Hitting him. Oh, oh, oh. I thought you meant hitting you like about to have to go get rid of it. Hey, Queen Hess. Welcome in. Thank you so much for joining and hanging out with us tonight. Come and say hi. I gotta go to bed. Have to work early tomorrow. You ate tomorrow? Sounds good. Thank you for coming in here. Have a good day at work. We'll catch you on our next one. Hey, crappie calf. What do my crappie jigs look like? Uh, I got all kinds of crappie jigs here right in front of me. This one I tied yesterday for a guy. It's a blue and chartreuse modeled uh, chenille on a chartreuse head. Got some crystal flash in the tail. Then... Uh, marabou jig wise got stuff like this hey ted welcome back in little marabou you'll hang out just a second i'll tie one for us here's another another jig i do a lot with deer tail on this channel Not right now, bud. Why? Because I'm showing these off. Wow. Here's a UV resin. UV resin body. Marabou. Well. Everything is on a... Um, flip you back around here. Oh... Get through all the feathers. Everything right now is on a um, must-add skipjack sickle hook. But I am in the process of swapping over to Victory V-Lock sickle hooks. So this must-add will not be here forever. They're still a good hook. And I've got a bunch of jigs right now with those. Um, on them. I'll tie us a crappie jig here right after this. Just kind of messing around, playing around with different materials and stuff right now for the for some river fishing on uh, streamers. For fly fishing. Let's throw us an eye on here. I got that brown, brown color. I'm not gonna put quite as big of an eye on this one. Let's see here, crappie calf. I appreciate it. Nice looking jigs. Thank you. I appreciate you dropping in here too. I don't know that I've ever seen you in one of my lives, so I sure appreciate it. And welcome in. Don't it. I assume by the name you like to crappie fish. I feel like it'd be a safe assumption. 
we do some crappie fishing. I'm trying to find my tweezers for my eyes here. We fish for anything that is biting, man. We're not, we don't uh, discriminate against anything. Yeah, that's kind of us, Ken. It don't really matter. We just like to fish. You hear a choo-choo train? Yeah, I do. What's it sound like? It sounds like a burp. Like a burp? You know what Denisha broke? Yes. Is it? Oh, that's Sophie's bird. Yeah. Uh, your big rod with the holder thing up on the foam. I did see that one. That was right before I had to run. Pretty awesome. Get those eyes stuck on there. It's a little bit crooked, y'all. Earl wanted to see the handle. Oh, find my flashlight before I get my resin dumped on here. The best video you've ever seen in your life. It's so sweet. Golden Retrievers are so pretty. They are pretty dogs. They're totally on one, but they're huge. They're big. Um, my friend Paige has one. Oh. Hen really? Yeah, he's got a Golden Retriever. Nice. Big old boy. They are boy big old boys. It's basically like a huge woolly booger. Kind of what this one looks like, turned out being. Which I'm fine with. Woolly boogers get eight for sure in the creek, so. Dylan. Why do you say stuff like that? Goofball. Right, let's see here. Earl wanted to see the handle. Oh, Mr. Earl. What? Oh. Nails, I mean. you know what you're talking about. Forgot you're watching the Golden Retriever video. Try that new reel. No. Oh man, those ugly sticks, Ken, you can't beat an ugly stick. I mean, they're awesome, awesome poles. They're not the most sensitive things in the world, but man, you'll be, uh... I love them. I love mine. Flip this around, show you how it turned out. Yeah, I love the GX2.
It's got a bunch of flash and stuff in it. All different sorts of flash. Hey, Yakshore, what's up? Welcome in. Basically like a huge woolly booger, pretty much. A three inch, three and a half inch long woolly booger. If I get really into the brim thing, upgrade my rod. But I've caught countless trout and shiners. Oh yeah. I think if you get into crappie, you'll eventually want to upgrade just for a sensitivity upgrade. But the um, there ain't nothing wrong with them. I mean, the GX twos are awesome. Yes. Yes. Let's scoot some stuff down. Make some room here. So this one turned out pretty cool right here. Yikes. Check this one out. Looking like a sunfish. Editing, got you in the background. I appreciate it, Yak Shore. You reckon this one's gonna get eight? Looking like a sunfish. Original. Gave it away to Carl. Oh, that Carl, yeah, that was in your live tonight. That's cool. Oh, Carl. There's the original jig I started with here on this channel, on this, my tying endeavors. I got a three eighths ounce i don't know what i keep it hung up there for a reminder to what not to do get these scooted over make some room here <laughs> make some noise i know you make noise loud noise and a quiet noise Five hundred dollars. Right, babe. I feel you. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Short said, "If that don't get eight, I'll eat a snake." I think he meant I'll eat a snake. Yeah, gave it away to Carl. That's cool. That's my buddy. Miss him tremendously. Probably my best friend. That's cool, Ken. That's awesome. It's good to have somebody like that, for sure. I'm going to tie my secret crappie jig. No, it's not a secret, but that root beer float. Guys, it has just been too good. We're going to get it on our website. Um, it takes a little more time to paint, especially because of the gold that I put in the paint with the, on that head. Put a little bit of gold on there, but let's tie some of these. Plus, if, um, oh, what was it? Crappie Kev, if he's still in here, he can watch this tie a crappie jig. Hess wants to know how Sophie's feeling. Uh, not real great. She's been napping. How are you feeling, babe, right now? I'm good right now. She's feeling good right now, but she's just up and down. Who's asking? Queen Hess was checking on you. She said I'm okay. She uh she's pretty sick. I mean just know that I'm not doing this again. Yeah, she said just know that we ain't doing this again. No, 
I guess I should have left my brown. I don't know what color to do with this. Probably black, I guess. All right, easier, good deal. Yeah, she's pretty rough, I mean. So I'll start off with that. Uh, let me till it down, Kev, if, you want, if you're interested in. You got the bug wanting another, okay. I won't tell her. <laughs> I'll zoom in a little bit for you, Kev, if you were, you're interested in watching. Um, I tie my stuff with a 210 Danville flat waxed thread. Get it all wrapped down towards the towards the tip of the hook there. I think if we get in a better place in life, we may try to adopt. That's cool. That's awesome, Ken. Dylan, don't empty that basket, please. Get my brown. This is brown brown bucktail. Bucktail is my favorite material. Fish wise and just to tie with and everything. So I get about however much I want for the tail on this jig. Probably about that much. Cut it off, tie it on. You have a couple of loose wraps and you can get that bucktail manipulated on the hook shank where you want it. And then you can wrap it down. Keep it tight as you get down to the head. Like that. So now we've got, got a good, good layer of good tail on there. Uh, this one, I put gold flash in. This is a, what what we call root beer float. It is my number one that I put a time lapse video up a few days back of I think I titled it tying my most productive crappie jig, and it was also this jig. So. Get one strip of gold, split it a few times, keeping the ends roughly the same. Doesn't have to be perfect. It's actually better if it's not perfect. And I don't go crazy with the flash, but two strips, it's one strip right now, but I'll put two on each side. Do I snag up? Oh, oh yes. Absolutely. I lose a lot of jig skin. You're fishing for crappie, you're fishing in brush piles and lay downs and submerged timber and yeah, I lose a lot of jigs. Cut that little bit off. Then I got gold chenille. It's just a bundle, 72 yards bundle there. Get the end of it. Lay it down on the hook shank. I tie back to where I want my body to start. Then go back up to the head, so you're waiting. 
hang that bobbin over out of the way, and wrap it up. I have seen them, yeah. They're pretty cool. Put that on there. Keep that body nice and tapered. Yeah, the hatchet heads are pretty sweet. I think they're supposed to cut through the water a little better. Maybe show up on sonar a little better. Hey, Willard. How are y'all? This fine Saturday. Man. Dig around the table to find what you need. Find your whip finish tool. Throw it up there. Napped it up. Napperoni and cheese. A little nappy. And there you go. That is the top producing jig that I have right now. Brown bucktail. That gold. Gets ate up. Should be good. What's up, buddy? Hey, what? Hey, every piece of fish later, I can, I can eat fish every piece of fish later. Oh, after I catch it? Yeah. We've got fish in the freezer. We should have ate some today. I mean, I want to eat some more after, later. Later? I put them in there for, uh, that was somebody's order. Hey, Caro. Welcome in. Yeah, I do break a lot of jigs off. Mm. Welcome in, welcome in. Got to learn how to get crappie in the creeks here. Um, now they're probably pushing back out deep, Ken. Yeah. But you catch them. Crappie do the fall spawn in the fall. Whenever the water gets to 62 and starts dropping below that, they go up shallow and act like they're spawning. There is no deep. Well... It's all relative. I mean, if you're in four foot of water and there's a creek channel in your lake somewhere that gets to six foot, they're going to be in that six foot hole. I got right, that's not to you. Yeah. Open it. Yeah, Our deep here, we're, I mean, they're going to be. Buddy, eggs. There's eggs. There's eggs in there. That's crazy. Here, show them the eggs. He said he brought me a present, and it's a bag full of styrofoam eggs. You're the sweetest, buddy. I'm the best right. sweetest. There you go. Catch you later, alligator. All right, see you later. Bye. Don't blame you. For sure. Let's make one more of those because I try to make everything in. Actually, usually I always make everything in threes. Hey, Glenn, how are you, sir?
Get some brown. Easter a bit early. Yeah, yeah, no joke. Uh, waiting on 11. So same thing. Grab two pieces of that flash. Glenn, have you caught any fish yet this year? Or Cairo, have you caught any? In 2024? Because I have not. Hey, Austin. How you doing, man? Welcome in. Hope you all had a good Saturday. Pretty cold today, but... That's all right. I got a new jig mold, so I poured a bunch of jigs today. Well, I actually only poured... I only poured 15 of the new ones, and then I poured uh, like 250 of these ball head jigs. Poured 108 ounce and a pun, uh, 100... 30 second ounce. I was out of 30 seconds. Hey, Lance, welcome back. Considering going out, it looks like a series of fronts. Yeah, it's gonna be, it's gonna be cold. The pour was good, Ken. That's um those heads I was showing off here. That new, that new jig that I got. It's a short, stubby, heavy. That's a quarter ounce. They're shaped like a minnow head. I've got to do some experimenting with the paint on them. See what I can get them to look like shad-wise. But um, here's one tied up. That's the, the green pumpkin uh, head. And then made that one try to look like a sunfish. Got the UV resin over the over the thread so it's all slick and shiny. Got a few few different ones. That's a 16th ounce. Little classic color. Classic bucktail jig color. Just the white and the red collar. This one right here is pretty sweet. All brown with a gold strip down the side. Hey, where's your dad at, babe? Okay. Yeah, he he's doing good. They're Okay. I think they're working on um getting a refrigerator moved in their house and getting everything stocked and whatnot, so torn between setting a trap line or fishing, but weather not great either way. Yeah. No doubt. Listening about those that quit smoking. It's hard, at least for me, it was. Don't give up the effort. For sure, guys. Let's put another, get another one of these done, and then we can build something else. Lance, I know you're into the fly stuff now more. Um, I built a giant woolly booger a minute ago. Did you see it? Get this wrapped up. And then Glenn, that's that root beer float, whatever color. We want to uh, we want to do the Coke float, grape slush, all the food, whatever names. We like that idea, it's pretty cool. So I got a, I got the tail for a grape slush thing, I think now. One of these guys be good all right snip that off
tied up. Austin says he's been cleaning out the garage. That's cool. There's another one. Missed it. Heard you talking about it, but was my head was in the edit. I'll show it to you here in just a second. Another one of those root, root beers. Check this out. Looks like a giant woolly booger. Pretty funny. Cherry limeade, orange crush, cream soda. Yeah, no doubt. The big old weightless streamer. It's going to catch me a bass in the river this spring. Flip it around now. They're out the kitchen. There you go. You can see it a little better. You got a bunch of. No, I know. Bunch of flash and stuff in it. There's from the front. Yeah, the picture's way better on that rear facing camera. Be all right. I'm excited about that one right there. It's going to get eight. Yeah, I like that one. Thank you. I appreciate it. I like that one a bunch as well. And we built this one just a little. Did I hear you say you're done fishing this winter? Oh, no, no. Not at all. I just um haven't been out this year. I haven't been out. It's been six days. We didn't go out today. Sophie was she, a little bit sick, so we stayed stayed home. And I, uh, I needed to pour jigs. We had an order um, come in. Got some guys' jigs done and... Get those all shipped out Monday. loop of that out for next time. See, I really... Grape slush would be like, ouch. That hurt. Grape with maybe a little bit white. Purple with white, with a white body. I've got this white that's going to be perfect for it because it's got some shimmery stuff in there. I wish I had some purple paint. You don't have purple paint? I do not have purple paint. I had some in my cart for a while, and then somebody was supposed to send me some, and I ain't seen it yet, so I should have just bought some, I reckon. Been working on my boat. That's cool. Let me see. Uh... Hey, Papa, I just stepped away. Hope you're doing good. Did Mamaw win it, Bingo? Went on the first, caught three brim, mostly took Hope out magnet fishing. That's cool. So what up with the new mold? Been working on your boat. Uh, the new mold is this little guy, Lance. It's a walleye jig mold. Looks like a stubby little, like a shad shape. Little shad shaped head. And here's one tied up. There's a
that's a 16th ounce with all that bucktail is going to fall fall super 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 slow which is perfect that white and green looks like what i need for flounder fishing white and green that's a beaut i do not ever troll you like it awesome good deal no i never do any trolling um Everyone rolls in when Mr. Barbecue comes. I'll tell you what. Didn't go good. Uh-oh. <laughs> that ain't no good. The white and green. Raised Bill Austin. All right, let's make a grape slush best we can. I've got a bunch of white jigs here. So I think obviously I'm gonna need, I wish I had purple. I used to have purple thread. I do have purple thread, sweet. That'll help break up all that white up there at the front. Dark and cold at Papa's house. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the, the lights will be off and oh well. Let's uh build this one here. No sir. Checking in from the north. Yep. The old north ones. I think with this, just a purple bucktail. I've actually got one that's a little more. No, they're the same. Okay. I could do marabou. I've got a really bright purple marabou. I just like bucktail. I'm afraid that's going to look almost... I don't know. Let's see what it looks like. I know it. I need, we've got to get over there, Glenn. <laughs> Raised outdoors. That's, uh, his name's Glenn also. Papa, the, my grandpa's in here. His name's also Glenn. I didn't want him to think I was addressing him by first name. Would never. Yeah, would never do it do it like that. Get the uh, get a piece of purple flash. I think this I'm just gonna have it down the belly side of this jig. Which right now is going to be the top. Let's see here. Yeah. 
Yeah, that would be a fun, a long line troll for crappie all the time. That's awesome. Kev, I'll make you a moderator too. Um, makes it easier to pick up channels and stuff if you're interested in that, so. Put that purple flash down it. <laughs> down just the belly side. <coughs> and we'll put some white. Used to do a lot of trolling. Used to. You can troll behind that John boat. It's hard to video trolling and get the action unless you have a static camera or multiple cameras. Yeah, I have no idea. Give me another strip of strip of this Chanel out of here. There we go. Now it'll be long enough to. Long enough to work with. Boy, that'll warm your heart. Catch a lot of big crappie and white bass trolling. I got to get over there, get on that lake with you and learn how to do some stuff. I'm going to troll for yellow perch. Static camera. Six grand. I think it just means one that's sitting there. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. This spring we'll go. You can bring your video game and check out check out the brush piles. That sounds good. I'll tell you where they're at, and you can make a note of them, mark them if you got GPS or something. What in the world? Why are you bringing it to me, buddy? That's Mama's. That's Mama's root beer. That's a root beer, huh? You brought it for me? Yeah. Okay, thank you. You can't have them there, dear. I'll definitely come. We'll definitely come over there, Glenn. Now. All right, let's see oh. how this one looks. Does this look like a grape oh, something? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought you meant, too. Just one setup not moving anywhere. I've got a few different mounts for the John boat. Upcoming Thursday videos will be good. Awesome. What do y'all think about that for the grape? Was it grape slush? What did we decide?
frosted grape. That's cool too. And that Chanel's got flash in it too. And then that purple thread up top. Got that on a raised mount, middle of the boat. I think I'm gonna tie one more of those, just like that, except out of Marabou. And then we can compare them. It's gonna be hard to beat that bucktail though. Had to Google it. Marabou gonna look great too, more bright, yeah. Fish out of a drum boat with a trolling motor, trolled it around one mile an hour. Works great for freshwater white bass, crappie bass. Flexi tripod, mounting camera on the bait table next to my seat, using a 16th ounce crappie jigs. Got some footage of bobbers going down, that's cool. I almost want to have I spy a yellow bulldozer. Yeah. I spy a till two or three years ago a John boat's all we had. We got a fifteen horse four stroke. Yeah, your that little Honda you got, Ken, is an awesome motor. Get some purple. I guarantee you, but what is it? What do you figure about 10, 15 miles an hour? That's moving. Mid twenties. Dang. Deer. That's cooking on. No in here. Where? What do you think? That's wild. Mid twenties is flying, especially on a fourteen foot John boat. <laughs> That's awesome. Over there making flies.
monster. Did Dad. you see a tickle monster? <laughs> Glenn, do y'all have a G3 now? Is that what kind of boat y'all got? One of these days, after the new baby's here and get everything calmed down from that, we're gonna look at getting a getting a new one. Um, not anymore, Lance. I tore it out. I had central heat and air installed. Um, I used to have a wood stove, but no more. We were super worried about Dylan getting into it whenever he was a baby. Yeah. That charger? Tracker, 1754. Awesome. That charger? Do you see Mama? I like it a lot. I like how yours is. How yours is built. Okay, that's enough. Just big aluminum boats, what I'm after next, too. I'm over the fiberglass. Wait, wait, close your mouth. Close your mouth. Which ours was super super old i mean it was a it's a 93 1436 alumacraft ain't nothing wrong with that we've got a 1436 also there's the purple marabou Wind effects aluminum. Oh yeah, for sure. Mine's a 15 foot. Um, mine's a 93 Tidecraft Spitfire. And right now the motor's not right. Hey Earl, welcome in. My motor's not right, so we can only idle. So if we uh, we get on plane, I think I've got a bad vacuum on my gas tank. I think it's the issue, but. happens quick one of my Amish buddies had one of their boys fall into the wood stove luckily arms first man <coughs> I've had plenty of aluminum boats last one 1866 wide that's a wide boat V with a 115 That's wild. There, Glenn, I think I sent you a picture of it, or I, I told you about it and meant to send you a picture of it. There was a boat for sale up here by us that was a... Um, thank you. Bless you. Uh, it was for sale up here by us. It was a huge John boat. It was like 20 foot, probably 6 foot wide. It was massive. I wish that Sophie and I would have bought it. Quarter inch welded hole. That's crazy. That's thick. That giant John boat that was for sale up there by our church. Wasn't it on the price? It was like thirteen hundred. It didn't have. It was everything was gutted. Yeah, we didn't. It didn't have a steering wheel. Tires were all flat on the trailer. Everything was gutted. There was no anything. They ripped the steering cables, all the electrical. Huh? All the electrical and everything out of it. And we just kind of, we passed on it. But I still wish we wouldn't have because it would have been a sweet boat to have. All right, let's see here. get this white since I got my um easier build but a lot of work for sure but she just come in she don't need to go potty is it cold outside Dylan no. it's not you sure ultimately I want to find a Starcraft Star Chief you don't want like a Boston Whaler 
I know. In the bottom of my Crocs, it's miserable. Yeah. Um, sounded like they were making a riverboat out of it. Yeah, I don't know where they were heading with that thing. Cuddy cabin boat. Okay. That's cool. Let's put a white bucktail and some pink flash and this white pearl. Pearl, uh body on this one look good I've got kip tail too calf tail but Fourteen. Pink is slept on. I can't stand pink crappie jigs. <laughs> Travis, it's so weird, man. The difference in um, in what people use, dude. Next Saturday is a high of thirty-six and a low of seventeen. A low of seventeen. Favorite jigs for dog salmon yeah. with a pink head and white feather. I couldn't find the right bunch of hairs for that one. I didn't like it. Yeah, it's so weird the different confidence colors and stuff. I am a brown, green, blue natural. Are oh, you talking about in soft plastics? I guess um, bubble gum and that kind of stuff was developed more for bed fishing, right? Just for sight. But then now, of course, like people use them just for everything. You're out of diapers? Yeah. Mama needs some more. I bet we can get you some more, buddy. I only use pink jig heads for crappie here. Okay. On the table, baby. I got some pink flash here. Kev, what part of the country are you from? That's why you're talking about pink being big malone said pink slept on he's also from over there in virginia no. confidence baits terminator jig and the culprit seven and a half inch yeah there's a lot of east coast guys Most crappie jig colors are the individual. 
Okay. Not necessarily what the fish like best. People like different or pretty. Oh, for sure. For sure, people like pretty and different. What, bud? Can you play for just a minute? Yeah. Well, yeah, go ahead. Yep. Mama told you that. South Central Virginia, North Carolina here was Oregon till July. We are, um, of course, natural state, Arkansas. So we're we're in Arkansas, right on the Oklahoma line. Sometimes on our channel, recently we've been running over to Oklahoma for uh, some bass fishing and whatnot. And pretty soon we're wanting to get down to Beaver Bend, Beaver's Bend State Park at Broken Bow and get on a get on some trout. It's supposed to be good trout fishing down there. You just have to go fight the Texans off to get to it. Oh yeah, there's Jay and Lance. Hey Jay. Jay is sent, sending me some jigs, guys. And what I think I'm gonna do with them is um, I'm gonna make a video fishing with them, catch some fish on them, and then maybe like what I don't use or some of the stuff I don't use or something, I'm going to uh, do a giveaway in that video. And I'm not gonna talk about it or anything. It's just gonna be one of those things you gotta be paying attention. And it's going to pop up like a, just a screen in the middle of the video. For a giveaway. Hey, leave her alone. You be nice and you go away. Because she's growling at you, Dylan. So go away. Go away from her. Bay, holler at Gracie. She's growling at Dylan. Go. No, you need to stay away from Gracie. <laughs> she ain't in the mood. Her's moody, huh? She's not, she didn't have food, but there's a... There's that pink flash. Pink head. Good fishing up there around Lake Anna. That's cool. <laughs> Popping in for a minute. Been prepping egg rolls for late night supper. Thinking if I relocate, it'll be like to Arizona. <laughs> if you mess around and spend too much time in Arkansas, Ken, you'll like it. I'm just telling you. You mess around and move here. Because it's, uh, it's nice. I wouldn't live anywhere else. Love an egg roll. Hey, Althea, yep, we're back at it. It definitely rains. 
Um, it snow is a lot more rare. I mean, we got hammered yesterday with some snow. We got like a half an inch and it like shut everything down. I mean, it's <laughs> bad. You're over it, huh? You ain't about that snow. I see snow on TV and it makes me angry. Let's go pink tail on this one, see what this looks like. Don't tell me You remember I always wonder how people live in a country with snow. Where are you from, Althea? What country? I'm horrible with flags. What flag is that? Does anyone else know? What are you laughing about? Who? Really? I don't think he's laughing. I think he's breathing heavy from all the jumping. Oh. Jamaica? Mm, I don't think so. Oh, nice, Ken. What? What? Awesome. Ken, get, Ken knew it. I was doubting him. I need to quit doubting you, Ken. Mama. 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 Jamaica. Yeah, Jamaica would definitely be warm, huh? Sunshine country. They're all custom jigs that were gifted to me from a farmer friend of mine that passed away 10 years ago, and you don't crappie fish. I'm excited, Jay. That'll be cool. That'll be a good video. It'll be a good giveaway. I appreciate you uh, giving it to us and sponsoring the vi giveaway or whatever, so... Did y'all get some of them at? We just got rain and a little sleet. Yeah, we got like a a heavy dusting. Maybe it wasn't. I get, I, I get. It wasn't enough to do do much. I hear it's beautiful. Really love the language. Talked on CB from Oregon to Jamaica when there was good atmosphere for Skip. Wow, that's a long reach on CB. Jamaican men love to fish. Cool. Yeah, don't. Can you go put this in the kitchen on the counter? Yeah. Okay. Why do you come out to 
I love jerk, <laughs> jerk kicking. A great culinary contribution from Jamaica. I don't know much about Jamaica except the music, I guess, the vibe from it. But it rains. Couples usually have a lot of kids. <laughs> better when it rains yeah raise is right Jamaican it's great to know I was too far into that one to quit reading it so I went ahead and I think this one's going to be a little better. A little better colored. That pink will be a little better for... For the... Color, I think. Oh, it should have been on a pink head, though. Dang it. Yeah, it's supposed to be on a pink head. Well, yeah, I was trying to do that same same jig, but on a pink head. Well, Not really. <laughs> I think Beba Finn's a little annoying. What? I think Beba Finn's a little annoying. Who's good here? Sunshine's marvelous. All is well yeah, once you on, around good people with good vibes. Oh, How it should be for sure. A lot of Jamaican dreams about traveling for a better life, but I just wish to stay here. Cool. I thought this one had a calf tail. Since we're, um, since I messed that last one up. Calf tails. Hey, Nene. How are you, Mom? What are you doing? You want to come here and say hi? Yeah. Say hi to everybody. You hadn't been up here yet, so. Oh. Don't let me down. Oh. Hi, 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 everybody. Yeah, you see everybody. Have friends that vacation to Jamaica every year. No. And I almost see some dinosaurs. Well, I don't know what to tell you. Maybe that's how Maybe somebody will, maybe, oh, Nene said hi, Dylan. She waving. See the wave hand? Yeah. I don't see the wave hand. A lot of Jamaicans dream to go to overseas when my kids are in Georgia. That's right down my mouth. Wish for me to live. Look, what's that? What are those? Hi. They're all saying hi to Dylan. To the pink hand? They said hi with the pink hand, yep. They didn't. They did. They all did. They did. Hey, you, you dropped some in that. I know. There's actually a lot. A few soft baits in there, too. They definitely you have a little seed made up there. With around Cypress. Okay, cool. 
Do you see the hooks on there? I do see the hooks on there. They're all waving. Look with the pink hands. See the pink hands? Yeah. I can't see them. It's just a battle to who can look around each other, huh? Ethan hey, Stuart. We can Ethan have this dozen minutes. We can get this <coughs> minute. Here, quit. Can we move that way? They need a Hulk juice. See I it? see that Hulk juice, yep. Where did pink hands go? Mm-hmm. Right, let's get one more piece of this. Um, I don't even know no, no more. Stuart says, hi, Dylan. Happy fly dying, tying day to you. Well, hi. <laughs> Those are big old eyes. They are some big old eyes. Yeah, I got big old eyes. I got big old eyes. What'd you eat? Eyes. What's on your mouth? Ah. Uh, Is what? it brown? Yeah. It's Did you eat some ice cream sandwich? Uh huh. Was it yummy? Uh huh. I just said. Like that to the sandwich. Oh, is that what you did to the sandwich? Yeah. Well, poor sandwich. It's not a mad sandwich. Hmm? I don't know. Hang on, wait. No, don't go. Why do you want to go under there? I mean, what? What? They were arson in this, in this thing. Mm. This is all the dinosaurs. Look at all those dinosaurs, Daddy. Somebody send a bunch of dinosaurs. Oh, yeah, that's Baba said hi. Oh, by the way, I just saw the pink hand. They, they just wave at that pink hands. Yep, bunch of pink hands. Look at all of them. Did they taste like deer tails? What? Did they taste like deer tails? Yeah. They did? Yeah. The ice cream sandwich did? Yeah. Oh, well, sorry. Mama didn't need me a haircut. She's crunching on something. Bae. Crunchy. She's crunching stuff. I don't see her, but. Can I go? Can What's she I eating? What's she eating? You put it on the floor so Gracie can get it? No. You put it on the floor? Yeah. So Gracie could get it? Huh? Well, Gracie got it. Gracie's a bad girl. <laughs> you can't leave food on the ground, buddy. She'll eat it and then she'll throw up. And then I'll wall her in it in the morning trying to get out of bed. My foot Here. isn't You ready? Enough. You ready to go? All right. See you later, I'll get her. Yeah, yeah, I, I took <laughs> More pink hands. Thank you. He's gone. Oh. You're running away? Yeah. I'm, I'm running really fast. Hey. Look at my feet. Tell me I'm using my feet. That's not my own. I'm touched. Need pink dinosaurs, yeah. <laughs> Don't hunt anymore. Don't fish as much. You should be fishing all day, every day. Whether it be on a lake, river, or creek. Oh, yeah. Good girl. Leave her alone, bud. She is a good girl, but... Did you just break your... That scream sounded like it hurt. What, babe? What'd you say? 
Oh, okay. Get off the couch, bud. Oh, going out. Been fun. All right, Mr. Ken. Have a good night. We'll uh, see you on the next one. Check out that pink tail. Turn it here. That flashlight's broken, yeah. Yeah, you killed it. You left my spotlight on. There you go. That's calf tail. Calf tail. Profile pick is better. I can't see it. Dylan, Dylan. Yeah, Daddy. Acting crazy. Yeah, Daddy. It's a good one of you. What? I can't tell. I can't see it. Oh, Daddy, look. What happened? Oh, my trout magnets. Bud, why are you always acting so crazy? And it just fell? Yeah. And, and it, I didn't do that. Grace oh. Didn't do that. Who did it? Gracie. Gracie did it? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> you need. You better quit lying, buddy. I'll mess you up. Oh, Santa, yeah. Is not yeah is Santa on there? Santa's not on here. Nope. Yeah, he was on here earlier, yeah. Pick those up, please, yes. That would be great. Nope. Yep. Hey, Mama, don't come in here. Mama, don't go in there. Why? Because he's picking up the mess. Maybe that's and maybe you better quit lying, buddy. And failed. Gracie knocked it down? I don't think she did. Santa heard that. Thank goodness he gone. Make a hackle feather jig out of this one. Do white and then a green feather or two. Get that hackle. Uh, I got a couple of different bunches of white. That one's a little better. Tips are a little finer. Yes, Dylan. I'm not. Are you? Yeah. Huh? Mama's messing with Gracie? Yeah. Uh -huh. I don't think she is. Daddy, I'm not, 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 I'm
Oh, okay. Gonna shorten this down some. All right, Jay, you out? Football's over. Time to cook the egg rolls and chili with my baby. Have a good night. Egg rolls at 10 p.m. So he's like, can I come over? Hey, what's up, Dathan? How you doing, man? Tying it up. I got some. Uh, some smallmouth candy tied a minute ago. I'll show it to you. See what you think about on a fly rod. This guy. Little streamer. Big Malone's about a crab rangoon now. And this guy was pretty. It's like a giant woolly booger. Flip it around, show you on the back side, camera. Look at that guy. Because she's terrified of you, buddy. I think that's going to get eight on the river. Yeah, me either, man. I'm pretty excited about it. Dylan, what are you doing? I'm gonna put meat and rice in my egg rolls. Nice, thank you so much. That thing will catch fish. Oh, yeah. I hope. I got just a piece of that green feather. Put just a strip of that green down each side here. That is a shiny one, yep. I'm ready for the, to get some Helgramites out to the creek. I miss creek fishing. I always miss creek fishing in the winter time. Now we've got those wide gap Ned rig heads to use on those Helgramites. I got those a little barren crawl too, but when I'm creek fishing, I just can't put the Helgramites down. They're too good. Yep, she's terrified of you. Nope. Yep. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna run till midnight. I, I might build one more streamer because I've got some long purple tails. I mean, long purple feathers back here that I wanna use. Check this dude out. Little hackle feather.
like that. What time is it? 1030. I'm going to build this last streamer, guys, and then I'm going to get off here. Um, you broke it, yeah. Get off the couch. Don't jump off the couch. Don't jump. Yeah. Yeah, the bobcat. Hatfield bobcat mascot. That would be cool. All right, let me swap out here to some purple. I'm gonna make a pretty big streamer. Green and white, yep. Oh, Hatfield. Love that idea. That is cool. I don't probably I don't think anyone else would know. But I don't guess it really matters. If they know why it's named it. Oh Yak Shore still editing. If I miss anybody, I'm sorry. Trying to catch up my backlog. Currently uploading sixty shorts. Man, that's crazy. 60 shorts. That's wild. This one I'm going to wrap up with some lead wire. Make this one heavy. Drink that. Drink it. I will later, buddy. Are you leaving her alone, Dylan? Yeah. Not Mama, Gracie. Oh, no one else would get the bobcat, yeah. End of the month, coming to your part of the country in search of sushi. Nice. Wrap this lead wire up around here. Did you just shush me? Yeah. I'll mess you up. He's scared, you can tell. You hear him? He's scared and he's frightened. Are you scared? No. I'll mess you up. You're scared of me? The dog in the bathroom. No, the, the, the monster in the bathroom. There's no such thing as monsters, buddy. It, is monsters not real? Monsters are not real, no. Mom, is monsters not real? No. Thanks. I, I like monsters. I'm the baby now. She twas a bobcat, yep. <coughs> oh, me, a birthday dinner. Oh, you don't owe me anything, but I'll uh, I'll definitely take a dinner. I mean, I ain't gonna argue with it. Get this all wrapped up. Oh, I forgot my purple was doing that stupid backlashing thing. I forgot it was doing that.
I forgot. I don't know why it's doing that, but it, it's going to break. Yeah, that was lead wire. So that's now weighted. It's a heavy, heavy hook. Gracie alone. Why? Because I told you to. She just told me that? She's going to get tired of it and she's going to bite your face. What? What? Leave her alone, Dylan. Okay. Put you outside. What? Me outside? Put you outside. Yeah, and let Gracie stay in here. That lead concerning handling it and then eating my popcorn, whatnot. Man, this this purple's purple's messed up. <laughs> it's lead. I mean, it, I wouldn't chew on it for sure. It's lead wire. Wash your hands, yeah. It's got like a... I don't know. I don't even know how it's... How this has happened. We got it. Now they've wasted 50 yards of a 100 yard spool. Anyway, now we're back. Oh, let's see. You'll just forget things during those years. You sit around and drool on yourself, it'll be okay. Which is really just good life advice. Just washing your hands. Just at all times. All right, we're back. Now, as we were doing before, we were so rudely interrupted by our horrible thread. Uh, interruption. I don't know what to call it, but all right. I got some long purple hackle feather here. Get a couple of these. There's a good one.
<laughs> he just told Sophie to calm down. It's not funny, but... Call that one Purple Rain. That would be good, yeah. Print, isn't that a print song too, isn't it? All right, good night, Hoss. Buenos noches to Ceci. And uh, we'll catch y'all on our next one. Your dad's going to bed too. What in the world's going on? I'm the only one. I'm the last last of the Mohicans. No, there's 10. There's still 10 people up in here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I knew he was your favorite. Who's your favorite? What favorite? Prince was my mom's favorite. Oh. What you know about some Prince? Me? Yeah. Uh, I don't even think I know one of them at all. He was pretty short. All right, good night, Baba. Love you all. Have a good evening. Ceci said good night. Good night, Hoss. Everybody. Everybody. Did he die? Yeah, he's 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 done left us. Hey. Yeah. Yeah, he gone. He's seven. What did he die of? AIDS. Of Pretty much the same thing. Okay. I said AIDS. No, it says accidental drug Yeah, year did he pass away? 2015? 2016. 2016. Purple rain, that sounds familiar. Yeah. How tall was he? Like. Huh? He's a little bitty thing. You're a little bitty thing. I'm, I'm, I'm three. He's not attractive at all. No. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he's kind of white. I don't know. So he says, is he black or white? Uh, I don't know. I have no idea either. He's got one of those skin tones that looks like he could be either. Wait, is it a boy or a girl? Prince is a male. No. Oh. There's one child. Is the purple rain song? It's like I saw you. I have absolutely no idea. No, baby, not today. I see it. It was a girl. Hey, Mr. Matt. Man, hang on. Let me get done doing what I'm doing here. And I'll show you uh, show you some jigs I got tied up with that new mold you sent me. <laughs> no, Dill does not know. <laughs> oh, no. Daughter-in-law. Okay, she said D-I-L. Daughter-in-law. Yeah, I read it as my deal doesn't know, and then it dawned on me. Yeah, daughter-in-law. Um, Matt, check this out, man. These things turned out great. She doesn't know. That is the quarter ounce who Prince was. That's that quarter ounce on a one aught. And then there's a black one, same, same size. It's got some glitter on it or whatever, but 
I like it a lot, Matt. I appreciate it so much, man. I'm gonna send some jigs your way too for Here's one tied up. Little bucktail with a that's a sixteenth ounce on a number six. That is a number six hook. See it up against my finger, it's little. It's actually the exact same hook that I use for my three thirty second ounce um crappie jigs. But it moved up to a sixteenth ounce with this mold. I love it. Got a, this one looks like a little sunfish. A little UV resin over the, over the head, over the threads. Got some brown, green, orange, green pumpkin face. It's just a little bit triangled shaped. That one's got a, imperfection in the paint what the heck show sure enough dripped a little bit the green pumpkin is the hardest color i own to get to pour right i mean paint right it's so thick i don't know what the deal with it is anyway yeah i really appreciate it man i love those things see i've got I poured up three sizes. That's a quarter ounce on a size one aught. And then that's a eighth ounce on a size one. And then the sixteenth ounce on the size six hook, which I really like this one a whole, whole lot. But it's the exact same size hook as my 330 seconds. Same exact hook as my 330 seconds crappie jigs. Pretty sweet. I'll send you some. Can you use them? Well, I'll, I'll tie a few and I'm going to send you a package of jigs just for sending me those, man, because those are super, super nice. That, uh, that mold's awesome. And I really appreciate it. Yeah, I love that smaller hook. Yeah. I'll send you a few, man. I got a classic one. Just a white and white and red throat. Look like the gill plate, maybe. Uh, tied up a purple. With a blue head. I was just playing around trying to trying to find colors and stuff I like. But that 16th ounce with that small hook is going to be clutch. Especially just waiting for it to fall down along like a, um, a rock ledge, a bluff or something. It's going to be money for sure. I'm about to attempt to make like a thread dam and make a head on this, but I don't know how well it's going to work out, but it might work. It might not. If it doesn't, this is my jig anyway, so. I'm going to use a bunch of hair off of that tail, but that's all right. I got a bunch of white tails in a, in their freezer. Right, let's get all that fluff out of there. Got 19 likes. If somebody in here hadn't hit the like button, if you want to make it an even 20, I'd sure appreciate it. That's right. That's what I say. I don't know what I said. Uh-oh. Oh, if it turns out bad, it's yours. 
Tying up now. Sweet. I wish I could send you a link right now. I'm, I'm, I don't do StreamYard, and I didn't do the go live together thing, so I can't send you a link to join me. Plus, I'm getting off. 21. What? Sweet. Thank you. All right. So we're going to see what we can do here with this. Oh, I love it. Very glad you liked the mold. Wanted to go to someone with the love and passion you got. Man, that's awesome. I really appreciate it. I love it a lot. I'm gonna make a lot of, a lot of super cool stuff with those, uh, with those heads. All right, get my hair stacker, wherever it be chilling at these days. I had it today, so I know it's right in front of me. Yep, there it is. Right in front of me, right where I left it. bet we got us a deer walking through right now because my Australian Shepherd's barking and she generally doesn't bark unless there's something out there. She doesn't just booger bark at stuff. But she will bark at a deer now. She ain't. She ain't too good to bark at a deer. <laughs> yeah, I like that mold a lot, Matt. I really appreciate it. For sure. Bloodhound used to go nuts. Good mic. Can y'all hear her? Haven't had any deer for myself in three years. I ate from other people, but haven't been hunting in a while. I got you. You can? Nice. I don't have any kind of mic. It's just my phone. Also, she's just... I'm. This is an exterior wall right here, and she's just on the other side of it, outside, so. Just six-foot porch, and then she's down in the yard, so. Faint, yeah. Going hunting in the morning. Nice. Yeah, still, uh, you have plenty of bow season left. In Arkansas, anyway. You got all the bow season you could want. I'm actually going to redo what I just done. I don't like that going all the way down. till 28th actually it's the 29th this year we got a sleep year so 
you got one more day. Uh, not that it really, you know, one more day doesn't make that much of a difference, but you might kill a, have one tag left and fill it on the 29th. You never know. You want to slide down the slide at the playground later? Yeah. Not right now? No. What do you want to do right now? Play for just a minute more, and then you're going to go night-night? Mm -hmm. Oh, there you go. Yeah? You making fun of me? What? Huh? What? Are you making fun of me? Yeah. I'll mess you up. <laughs> I really wish that you would get away from Gracie. You're stressing me plumb out. Her will. She's going to. Is your mama asleep? Can you get him away from Gracie? Dylan, get away from Gracie. I'm not away from her. Get down. I'm awake. Off the couch. Dylan, get away from her. I'm awake. Now. Get off the couch, bud. Come here. Okay. Gracie's propped up on the back of the couch, and he is... Right in her face with Barbie dolls and, or not Barbie dolls, little G.I. Joe action figures. And she'll get tired of it. Send a video. Sweet. I'll check it out here in just a second. As soon as I get off, uh, off of here. All right, I think I finally got the head where I wanted it there. Got all winter weather yesterday, rain, sleet, snow, big wet snow, white out. That's crazy. Everything's back in groups, yeah. Yeah, I figure. I think the bucks are starting to drop, drop their antlers off a little bit too, huh? Dylan, mommy is going to mess you up. She's going to. Her will. Find the the eyes for the. Believe it or not, I am biased. You? Yeah. Are you talking to me? You're still finding fresh rubs? Nice. Digging the white and purple. I like the one in the vice in the video. All the flash with them wings. I like the one in the vice in the video. Oh, oh. The video you sent me? Yeah, I'll, um, I'll go check that out here in a minute. I'm getting off as soon as I get the eyes resined onto this jig. Sound good? This is a pretty sweet color right here. No rush. I'll watch all night. Yeah. I'm, I love it. I have a blast up doing this, but everybody's winding down in bed or winding down.
put those eyes on there. I might do this, these eyes one at a time, because that one's being a little, being a little something. Can't see when I get my finger in the way. This one needs to be perfectly flat. Yep, deer's back. There's no telling. It could be a... We've had possums in the get in the fence with them trying to get to their... Trying to get in their dog food. And yeah, we had a bear up on our porch one night. Yeah. Gonna look nice in the water. Oh yeah. I'll go wet it down. So we can check it out and see what it looks like. It's got those big old big old eyes on there. I'll put some more resin. Kind of make a bridge across. Connect those eyes together real good. Like that. Billy. Are you doing something to make him laugh? No, I'm not doing anything. <laughs> He's just being a stink. He don't mean to. Get down. Get down. I hate it when that stuff bubbles up. I don't know that I'd be bragging about that, buddy. Um, I'm driving mama nuts. You're driving mama nuts? <laughs> what just happened? He fell. He's tired, but won't go to bed? I don't know. I don't want to be doing that. Okay, your daddy's probably good. Okay. Dylan, if you don't go to sleep right now on mama... You're going to end up having to go to sleep on me because Mama's about to give it up and go to bed. Her will. Her will. Yeah. And, and then it's just going to be me and you. I'm going to be up all night with the sun. If that glue gets on the table, it's not a good thing. Uh, it wipes right off, but if you cured it, <laughs> I don't know. If you cured it on the table, I don't know what it would do. The nail polish takes the stain off of the table. Yeah. Sophie said the nail polish takes the stain off of the table. The clear coat that we use for sealing the threads.
let's see. Mama's gonna put him in a sleeper hold. Oh, <laughs> I know. She don't play. Her don't want to play. No, Mama don't want to play, does she? Nope. Mama's mad. Mama's mad? Yeah, I just got her Big old, big old head on that one. It's a little more round than I actually. I like it. Oh, I like it. Those eyes. Let me go wet it down. We'll see what it looks like. You got all your what? All, all your edges. I don't know what you're saying. Oh. All my edges. edges? Hang on, I'll show you in just a second. All right, here she is wet. Looks a lot more. A lot more uh, shad-like. Pretty nifty. Hang it up and let it dry and take her to the river. Very good profile. Thank you. That one, um, before you come in, I think I'd wrapped a bunch of lead wire around the shank of the hook. I've got this spool of lead. It's just a, you know, whatever, little lead wire. You can. Yeah, 35,000 lead wire. Weight it down and uh, make it where it sinks. So that'll be, be a good one. You could actually throw that one on a spinning rod. It's heavy enough. It's probably, it's probably a sixteenth or an eighth of an ounce. Just that little bit of lead wire we put on there. Weighed her down, so pretty neat. Looks like it's still zoomed in. I guess it ain't. Anywho, man, there's all kinds of, like, filters and stuff on here, too. I've never messed with. There you go, dance party. Anywho. Um, one-aught. It is probably a one-aught. I'm not sure the size. It's just a little streamer hook. It come in a tackle box full of fly tying stuff that I picked up. Have I heard of putting fabric softener in the water? I have not. What's that supposed to do? Just soften them up, I guess? Daddy, 
get. All right, guys. I gotta get the lights turned down so he can uh, he can go to bed because he's fighting it because the lights are on. I think we got church in the morning. I got on here an hour early, so it was the same length as as if I'd went to midnight. So that's cool. Still got some watch hours. I appreciate everybody hanging out with me tonight. We um, tied a few cool things, tied some stuff that might not have been too cool. Oh, they lay down after they dry. Okay, cool. I'll have to try it out. I'll Google it and uh, I'll find it and read about it and see what they say. Pretty cool. Yeah. All right, y'all. Have a good evening. Thank y'all for hanging out and we'll catch y'all on our next one. See you later.